Got five on it. What's up, everybody? It's Brock and Hunter. Welcome to it, the Plan B After Show podcast, web exclusive. Oh, exclusive. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, you know that's right. Uh, let's get right to it. It's time for another back in the day. Da, 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 da. Uh, here we go. Back in the day, August 3rd, 1492. 531 years ago, that piece of shit Christopher Columbus set sail for the <laughs> Orient from Paulo, Spain. Oh, here we go. Three ships, here the Nina, go. the Pinta, the Santa Maria. So, yeah, I think we all... Why was that just so recent that everybody started to realize that he was a POS? I mean, I think we always knew, but for some reason... Like, I just I didn't know he's known. They always it. taught us in school that he was... Like, dude, it was a big fucking deal. Yeah, like, we did we had a whole assemblies... Day on this day, 1492, Columbus yeah. sailed the ocean. Learned the blue. song, and then we realized, oh, there was genocide and 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 thieving and, and like and, yeah. and rape and slavery. Like holy shit! All the worst things, like all the terrible things: mm-hmm. death, slavery, theft, rape. Yeah, and here's all, the thing: all of the commandments. He wasn't. He he was lost. He wasn't even. Tra- he wasn't even sp- like aiming for America. Mm-hmm. So did yeah? Didn't he call them Indians because he thought because they were, he yeah he was he, he was landed like, in India right or India something? right yeah yeah and that's why they're called I- I- Indians. That's because that way dumb off, motherfucker man. got lost, man. Yeah. yeah. How do we wait with this guy? We need to get rid of the day. We don't need Columbus Day anymore. Sorry. Yeah. I mean, now look, I'm not saying that it wasn't a very important milestone. Yeah, but, but somebody was going to do it, right? Let's not build Eventually. this guy up, and you know, maybe or if we are teaching the children, I'll also be like, hey, by the way, he did some pretty uncouth things. You right. know what I mean? Right, yeah. right, right. Maybe right. we don't we don't have children sing songs. It's great to glory. discover things, and you know, do, but he was kind of a pos beyond that. So right. what if he didn't? Then what? That's a good question. I it would be totally different. Our history, our history would be. Comp- oh, I think so. Yeah, for sure. I think so. What? Think what so. if someone else? What? If, what if someone else found it? What if someone else found it first? Yeah. What if? Uh, well, technically, did, didn't the didn't the Spanish the conquistadors find it before? I mean, there were people here. Yeah. You know, yeah. just saying. I, I, I. I mean, I don't know. I'm not. A, yeah. I'm not a historian. You know, I know a little bit about history, but. You would think somebody eventually would have ran into it and said, "Hey, you know, this is well, it's for good sure." Land. But I mean, think what if what if someone from I don't know England found it first? You know, what if someone from because he was uh, he was uh, was he Spanish? He was uh, a Spaniard, right? A Spaniard who wandered the North Spaniard. Uh, <laughs> Spanish. Yeah, I'm not was, sure. Yeah, he no, he was he was from Spain. Yeah, yeah, he was he was a Spaniard. But anyway, I, it'd be a different history for sure. Uh, here's a fun little uh, fact for you too. The voyage cost about seven thousand dollars, three thousand for his ships. His personal salary of three hundred dollars a year, and two fifty uh, two dollars fifty cents per crew member per month. Mm. I wonder what's that in uh, in today's time. That's probably a pretty good wage, honestly. What sounds, would sounds like two dollars and fifty cents back then is is big money. Um, this is big money. What would Christopher Columbus's thousand dollars a ship? I mean, you think about today's thousand dollars is still a lot of money. Cost yeah. today. Oh, yeah, for sure. Oh, that was big money back then. Uh the voyage cost approximately two million Spanish Maradives, according to the Fed. Uh that would be about fifty cents today, which would mean Columbus voyage cost a million current US dollars. It would cost a million dollars to do that today. Dollars, which yeah. that actually doesn't seem too bad. Right? Yeah. That many people and everything? I don't know. Anyway, let's move on from Columbus. Uh, yeah, right. Let's see. 74 years ago in 1949, the NBA was formed when the Basketball Association of America merged with the National Basketball mm. League. Old-timey basketball before the three-point line. Yeah, before the where they had a wicker basket. Ah, <laughs> some of those old videos, man. You're like, Dude, it is funny watching some of those yeah. old videos. Those there guys a, would get absolutely destroyed. There's definitely gaps in between talent. Yeah, know? for sure. For sure. Wow. Um, let's what see. What else you got? Uh, Nothing. Def Leppard released Hysteria. All right. That was a that was a big album. Dude, that had like Bang. eight. 
That like had like eight songs that were released as singles. Fucking wild. A lot of albums back then were like that. They had a lot yeah. of good singles on them. Now they spread them out. Now they just release a single and try it's, to Yeah, that. it's like it's not even the full album usually. Right. Yeah, but no, what was crazy about that one is it released in 87 and then like it was still dropping singles in like 1988. Wow. You had hysteria, uh, hysteria, pour some sugar on me, Armageddon, it, love bites. I mean, it was a massive album, dude. Mm-hmm. Uh, hmm. That's pretty much it. It was kind of, kind of quiet, kind of quiet today. So, you know, I just realized we can chat with people here in the bottom right corner. I didn't know that. No, you can chat with each, just us. Oh, yeah. oh, in the studio, yeah, yeah, in the studio, yeah. Or if it's a live stream, are you not even paying attention? They're dicking around with. <laughs> It's just, it's just horsing around. And I think I lost you now, too. Did I lose you? Yep. I lost you. All right. We're going to end it. That's the After Show Podcast. We'll see you. This is terrible.